I know my sister is gone. And it's not because of something that she did. Her life was taken because we have young men just picking up a gun, not knowing what to do with it, don't know how to shoot, don't know how to aim. Some powerful words there from the sister of Carisha Johnson. She's that pregnant woman who was shot and killed early Sunday morning. Police have arrested three 19 year olds for her murder. Our Lester Dewey was at a vigil tonight where her family is pleading for justice. Lester. Yeah, guys, Carisha's due date was actually tomorrow. She was expecting a baby girl named Mackenzie. Now the family is making funeral plans. And tonight we've got new video of the moments after the shooting took place. Family and friends gather today at the very same spot Carisha Johnson was gunned down early Sunday morning as she was picking up family members from a party. If you don't have anyone else, you're supposed to have family. So we had each other. So now I have to hold on to my other siblings. Johnson was pregnant with a baby girl who she was going to name Mackenzie. The unborn baby also died. That's what my mind has been on. I don't have my sister and now I won't have my niece because a baby brings so much joy and he brings the family together. Family members say Carisha, also known as Kiki, had a beautiful smile, a great laugh, and she loved to eat seafood. The balloons in her honor were blue, her favorite color, as Carisha loved to think about the ocean whenever she was having a bad day. Imagine that we are on a beach with white sand and the water is crystal blue. I say there's nothing and no one to bother us. We put our feet in the water and it's just peaceful. And that would be our peaceful place to go to together. Police say Carisha was just at the wrong place at the wrong time. They arrested these three 19 year olds for her and her unborn child's murder. New video from a witness tonight appears to show people running from the scene of a party after the shots were fired. I hope they catch whoever did this, all, whoever else did it. I hope they catch you and we get the justice for my sister that we need. I just feel like she didn't deserve that. And the people that's got, the people that did it, they gonna get what's coming for them. They are not coming home no time soon. The family wants accountability. She treated me like she birthed me. And I'm just lost the words. I don't know what to say. And they want an end to this senseless gun violence in our city. With all of this confusion, right now all I have is my faith. No matter what comes, no matter what matter what goes, I know Jehovah is going to keep me and my family. Now, police tell me more arrests could be possible in this case, and the family says Carisha's funeral arrangements are still being worked out at this time. Guys. All right, Lester, thank you for that and their family's perspective. We appreciate it.